श्री साई राम मानव सेवा इज माधव सेवा सर्विस टू मैन काइंड इज सर्विस टू गॉड टाइम एंड अगेन भगवान हैज रिमाइंडेड अस टू प्रायोरिटाइज सेवा बट व्हाट डस प्रायोरिटाइजिंग सेवा मीन डू वी ड्रॉप एवरीथिंग इन आवर लाइव्स आवर रूल्स एंड रिस्पांसिबिलिटीज एंड डू ओनली सेवा surely that can't be it bhagwan himself has given us these multiple roles and responsibilities to play in life so what does bhagwan mean when he says live to serve here's a short play titled seva before self that will be presented to you by bhagwan's children the drama will echo the many challenges we face and show us how to excel in the tests and tribulations of our life by putting faith before fear and seva before self let's see what happens in the lives of these young men and women who are regular volunteers for narayana seva hey all the best for today I really hope you can reach as many needy and hungry people as you can during Narayan Seva. Listen, are you ready yet? You'll be late for Seva. You should leave immediately. Don't forget your phone, wallet and car keys. Yes, yes. I'm on my way out. Oh, wait. I just received a meeting request from the office. the company ceo also will be attending this meeting i don't think i have a choice but to attend it i don't think i can go today hmm never mind now i better drop a message to the brothers that i cannot come today let me start preparing for this meeting hold on If you don't go, how will they find a volunteer to substitute for you on such short notice? But what choice do I have? I am sure Swami and the volunteer brothers will understand my problem. Even if you don't go to the meeting, the meeting will still happen. They might miss you, but work will go on despite your absence. But if you miss seva, hundreds of people will not get their dinner tonight. and that will be on us just pray to swami and go for seva i'm sure everything will be fine you are right let me go for seva i will try to join the call while driving the rest i leave to swami i have to leave in 5 minutes for seva but the maid hasn't come still There is so much work for her to do when she comes. The children also have exams coming up. I don't know what to do. I don't want to miss Seva. But what other option do I have now? I will have to do all the housework now or else I won't be able to help the kids with their studies in the evening. Seva is more important. If I don't go, the packing will get delayed and people won't get their dinner on time. I will come back and finish all the housework. It's a little extra work, but it's okay. Swami will take care. Hi Dilip how are you both Arvind and I are here only wait let me put you on speaker Hey hi guys the Marvel movie is out finally let's go i'm too excited i'm booking the tickets as well how soon can you guys come we could catch a pizza for dinner after the movie mm, can i call you back in 5 minutes let me discuss this with Arvind Sure 
Oh no. I totally forgot this movie was coming out this week. What do we do now, Arvind? We have Seva in the evening and the Marvel movie apparently it's awesome, man. I don't want to miss it either. Hey, yes. The reviews are great. I would have loved to watch the movie, but not today. Brother, we must go for Seva. The film will run in the theater tomorrow too, but the hungry people need us today. Hmm. You're right, Arvind. Thank you for putting some sense into my head. Seva is more important on any day. Let me call Dilip and tell him we'll be joining them for dinner later tonight. Hey guys, should I come pick you up or are we meeting at the theater? The movie is going to start in an hour. There are also rumors that Doctor Strange is making a special appearance. I can't wait to watch it. Uh sorry bro, uh, but both Arvind and I have some personal work to do now. But let's catch up over dinner. We'll come to the pizza place directly. Man, you guys are such killjoys. I don't know what keeps you busy on all Friday evenings. Youth is the age for us to live and spend time with friends, and you both are always missing out on the fun. I'm so disappointed in you guys. Swami, I've become so old and fragile. I'm not able to do. any seva i have all the time in the world but my body doesn't cooperate huh. what do i do swami bangaru why do you feel so bad make a little extra for me today when you cook your food and that is also seva ho oh, swami what a beautiful trick of the mind to make me feel better like cooking a little extra food can be seva so what does bhagwan mean when he says live to serve all he means is to add seva to our lives such that it is not the first thing we strike off our to do list when challenges come calling social obligations household chores office work these will always come in the way but when we make our life choices selflessly god himself swoops in to save the day let's see what happens in the lives of our protagonists when they put their faith in god and go for narayan seva I had the best day today. You won't believe it. The kids from the slums we distribute food at came running when they saw us. They were so happy when we arrived with the food. Thank God I went. Oh, that's so lovely to hear. I hope there weren't any issues with the internet when you had to take your calls from the car. What do I tell you? I'm just so glad you reminded me to put seva before myself. By Bhagwan's grace my call got cancelled the CEO's flight got delayed and he moved the call tomorrow morning indeed when you do god's work he does yours hmm <laughs> he does it even better than you i am sure oh yes yes What happened here? Everything is so clean. Even the vessels are washed. Mother, you're back home. We just came back from school now. I made Adya change her clothes and prepare for tomorrow's exams. That's very responsible of you both. I'm proud of you. But tell me something. Did you both even clean the house? Oh no, mother. We didn't do all the work. 
The maid auntie came a while ago. She was sorry that she came late and she finished all the housework and went. Okay, okay, come on now. Both of you go and resume your studies. Let me get some hot milk and snacks for you both. Oh my dear Swami, what a beautiful way to teach me that you are always around me. Everything at home is better than what I could have managed had I stayed back and not gone for seva. Indeed, when we prioritize seva, you take care of even the minutest things in our lives. Thank you, Swami. Hey guys, I hope we aren't too late. How was the movie? From the looks on your face, I guess it was really nice. Oh yes bro, you guys missed it. It was an amazing movie. But tell me, why are you guys looking so happy? Because we go for Nara and Seva every Friday evening. We distribute food to the hungry and we had the best experience today. We both felt slightly bad about missing the movie with you guys. But we couldn't miss the seva too, you know. So many people would have gone hungry had we not gone to the seva. Wow, and here we were sad that you had missed an excellent movie. I'm so sorry bro. But what is the seva all about? Can you tell us more? Maybe we can all join in next time. We would love to. Hey. Come, come, let's go inside the restaurant and talk all about it. Thank you, Swami. Everything has a happy ending when we put you before our wants. Just like in the movies. Amma, I'm starving. Can you please give me some food to eat? My dear child, wait, wait here at the door. Let me go inside and get you something to eat. Here you go, my child. It's hot pulao and curds. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you so much, Amma. I was so hungry and starving, Amma. I was praying to God and a voice told me to ask you. You are such a kind person, Amma. You are God to me. Oh, Swami, how can I thank you enough? I felt terrible. I couldn't do seva. And you brought the seva opportunity to me at home? My children talk about work from home. Today, I will tell them about Seva from home. It is said, where there is a will, there is a way. But where there is love, there are innumerable ways. Seva can knock on our doors anytime. And these opportunities are God sent to help us strengthen our faith and quality of life. All we need to do is to remind ourselves of who has our back all the time. We can trip and fall in life, but our Saima is always standing beside us, teaching us to get up and walk again. Dearest Saima, you are our mother. We may not always live up to your expectations. Scold us, chide us, but don't ever give up on us, Swami. Hold our hands and help us walk this path fearlessly and with confidence. On this holy day, Saima, we offer our collective love and gratitude to you for being the most beautiful part of our lives. Without you, we are nothing.